Hey guys, samosas are one of the famous snacks of India and world over. Majority of us are familiar with the Punjabi samosas, but the samosa I am going to make today is a bit different. These are small ones stuffed with beef and cheese filling. So let's get going. You are watching Simi's Kitchen Diaries and this is Simi and we are with you. A peep into the ingredients for this recipe. Please visit my website for all the details regarding the quantities and measurements. Into the preparation of dough first, add a pinch of soda by card and salt into the flour. Mix this well. Now we'll add water slowly and knead into a soft dough. It should not be very tight and it should not be very loose. We'll press this till we prepare our filling, covering with a cling film. Heat a pan with oil and add the onions. Saute for a couple of minutes. Add the salt and keep mixing till it gets wilted but crisp. The onion should not be fried for long. And in goes the ginger garlic chili mixture. We'll saute this till the raw smell departs. This is an easy to make filling with minimal ingredients. The onion mixture is ready now. Throw in the shredded beef. Saute this until well combined. We'll adjust the salt now. I haven't added anything while cooking the beef. Simply the beef and the water. That is, wanted the taste of the beef to be perfect and original. Add the finely chopped coriander leaves. This should be in plenty as the taste maker of this dish are the onions and the cilantro. Mix all these together until combined homogeneously. The filling should not be dry. There should be wetness of the onion and beef and it should be juicy. The filling is ready now. We will keep this aside to cool down a bit. Let's get on with the pastry sheet now. The dough is perfect now after resting. Make lemon sized balls out of these. I usually make tiny ones. You can go in for the sizes which you prefer. But I would say the tiny ones are the pretty ones and taste awesome. Roll out to round thin sheets around these sizes and cut into four. The filling has cooled down now and I have taken cream cheese here to put along with the beef filling and some water to stick the pastry. This is how we prepare the samosa sheet. Place the sheet on your palm. Apply some water to all the three corners and the periphery and fold from the round end to form a cone. Press firmly all the joints. You can see we have got a perfect cone here now. Place some beef filling first and then the cream cheese. Now close the other end, press and shape into a flat triangle. Repeat this with the rest of the dough. Frying time. Place the samosas in hot oil and fry till golden brown. Ooh la la, I've started getting yummy smell and samosas are ready now. You don't need any accompaniment for this as such. Can go with ketchup or chutney if you prefer. Enjoy your samosas with a hot cup of tea. Give a thumbs up if you like my video and subscribe to my channel. I am awaiting all your comments and feedback. Happy cooking and festivities. Bye bye and take care.